Thank you both for taking the time to chat with me today about your new film. This is a really sweet, very personal film. So I'm really interested to know, what were your initial thoughts after reading the script? Like, wow, like, mm -hmm. wow. That was my initial thought. And like crying out loud, you know, it just like mm -hmm. after reading the script for so many times, it was just, I was bawling the whole time. Such a personal, emotional, compassionate story that really hits you right away. Sophia, how about you? Um, yes, I love the script. It was really well written and I, I love the story and its characters, especially. I think Alan Ball really works well with what he does uh, best is um, he has a lot of empathy um, mm -hmm. as a person and in his work and just the relationships people have and what they go through and how people forgive each other and um, become more become accepting I just it's something that's it's really beautiful to see um, and just reading it I was like this is this is something I want to be a part of I just loved it and I, it was a care you know it is a study of these people and their uh, preconceived notions and, and, and their secrets and you know time and what time does to a family and a story and and a lesson and um it felt like it was uh, just really beautiful. I, it was even more beautiful finished than, than I thought it was on the page, which you know, you're, you're crossing your fingers about. But Now, Paul, what was uh, your first reaction after reading the script? I should preface this answer with, as a huge Alan Ball fan, <laughs> and I got a Aren't script- Aren't we all? <laughs> that said, uh, Alan wants you to play the lead in his, in his movie. So, um, uh, I, was, I, I, was, I was poised, I was poised uh, to, to, to say yes. And I read it and it has, I thought, one of the most beautiful, uh, beautifully wrought, elegant bit of writing in the, in the third act turn where you think, the audience thinks they've understood what is the, the original sin, what, what, what is the original sin of Frank, what is driving his sort of guilt and, and, and shame. And then when you, but then the twist that you, when the narrative punch that that carries, where it just catches up with you, how awful, uh, 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 and how how responsible he feels uh, for for what happened, um, I think was just so so brilliant. And then I, Alan and I got on the phone and talked a lot about uh, it and why me and what. Uh, I could bring to it and what we both thought it was about and who it was for and those sorts of uh, uh, important questions and we both were really aligned and I, 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 I frankly wanted to be in an Alan Ball movie. <laughs>